Happy holidays, everyone. Now this video is outdated. Now let's just get onto the actual video, which is why uh, Fortnite isn't Fortnite anymore to me. Now that I got your attention, you may be saying, "What? Why do you say this? Why do you say Fortnite isn't Fortnite anymore?" Well, to me at least, it doesn't feel like the game anymore. The game that was anymore can kind of split into two categories, maybe if I think of more along the way. But you can think of two categories: the seasons and the items that are in the 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 seasons are in the game. Uh, basically, let's talk about the seasons first. You know, currently we're in season seven. Again, I'm probably gonna outdate myself in about a month or two. It's gonna be season eight, season nine. You know, it's gonna be ten seasons, and to me, they don't feel as good as. Season 3 or Season 4, because, uh, that, they felt more like the game itself, and that could, could be because Fortnite's become this big popular thing, and Epic Games are just trying to cash off of it, which means that they're not gonna go think of something that fits for the game, they're just gonna, they're just gonna create stuff to make them money, if you get what I'm saying. Because if you look back at Season 3 and Season 4, when I played it, even for Season 1 and 2, but I don't know about that, because I didn't have the game then, but season 3 and 4, which I believe are like, they're, that's part of the game. Season 1 and season 4, I believe, are just the game. Like, that's what Fortnite is. So, um, if you look at season 3 and season 4, a lot of it was more in the season, like in the Battle Pass seasons, they're more, they looked better, looked nicer, it was less cluttered. There was, the skins looked nice. And season 4 had the theme of superheroes, which, kind of fan with Thanos, because they had Thanos well, and it actually fit well with that. Which actually was probably the reason why they, they, they did the superhero season, because of Thanos, because they got to deal with Marvel. But, they had that fit in with superhero season, everything kind of fit in with it, and um... Even with the season 3 with space stuff, they had the meteor, which are the whole Fortnite story, which even in season 4 was a story, there was a creator, which felt natural, because it was base superhero stuff, there's superhero magic, superhero and villain base, so they fit well. But season five is where things got a little bit iffy. That's what I call it's the part where I call Fortnite meme. It's a meme Fortnite. It's not no longer Fortnite the real game's now Fortnite in a meme. <laughs> like everything they do at this point is just a meme. They just want money. You know, they're popular, so they just want money. Or they get sad and things for no apparent reason that mean nothing. Like, for the Battle Pass, it's from Season 5 to now, like, they don't, like, Season 5 feels like it's part of the game, all the skins, but when you get into Season 6, it's like, not really. Same with Season 7, when I look at Season 7 Battle Pass, oh my god, I saw it. It looked like stuff from the other game. They don't feel like the game the Ice King in Season 7 Battle Pass does not feel like it should be in Fortnite. Same with Season 6 with the Dire, it doesn't feel like Fortnite. I guess season 5, season 5 was like world colliding, so it made sense that other, like, stuff came in. But it was all about time travel, so it's not, not like different dimensions, it's just, they could have done so much more, but they wasted it, because they don't, probably don't care. They put enough effort to put in, to our world and all that kind of stuff, but, you know, not really, I guess. My, my opinion, you need to be really truthful in the comment section, but I know people are gonna, like, say, Oh, Fortnite's a meme, but it's always been a meme. Oh, Fortnite sucks since the day it opened. No, it didn't, but... You, you can comment that. You see many people agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> now that you get to my second point, which is, uh... The, the items or stuff that's in the seasons of each season. Now, what I mean is that, like... Like, grenades, the balloons, the port fort all that kind of stuff. You know, grapplers. Before... I remember in Season 3 they added in vending machines, and those vending machines were useful or helpful. Same when Season 4 when they added in apples and mushrooms. But when Season 5 upwards, everything just seemed to be useless. Even the guns and the weapons. Like, uh, the only gun that seemed useful that I wanted to stay in the game is the drum gun. I feel like everyone had that. It's such a good thing to have. You can agree with me if you ever played Fortnite during Season 4. Whenever they had in season three, season four, season five, I don't remember when they got rid of it, but everyone had a drum gun. 
and turn every Fortnite streamer, every Fortnite YouTuber had a drum gun in their inventory, including myself. Everyone had a drum gun in their inventory. So I don't know why Epic Games were like, hey, let's just remove it. It wasn't unfair. It wasn't as fast as an SMG. Did it do more damage? I don't know. That's the only gun I get kills with. I remember, I remember taking out a, a, a duos when I was alone by myself, and I get to play duo, uh, solo duos, and I managed to kill two people single handedly without building anything. And uh, I mean, kill two people with a drum gun. So I like, I loved the drum gun. It was the first, one of the first guns I actually was able to get kills with. Then I got rid of it, and I was like, oh well, I'm screwed. Oh, uh, then I didn't get kills for about a couple months until oh, I got kills again with other guns. But the uh, a lot of the things that are in for don't work. Like balloons are completely useless. All they're used for is just. What, if you get three balloons, you flow up to the top, and if you... What's the point? I don't get it. Like, it, I guess it's a jump higher, but that wasn't the original purpose. They, they, the original purpose was to go all the way up and glide. But with, well, without got redeployed, there's no purpose that you just fall and die. It's just a suicide tactic until they change it again. And that's nothing. All these random items, they don't... Their, their usefulness just reset like it changes. And there's just so many of these items. <laughs> like, yeah, I have a port of fort. Then they yeah, added a port of fortress. What's the point of a port of fort if you have a port of fortress? Get rid of the port of fort. But with the whole drum gun situation, could I get rid of the SMGs? I kept the drum gun. But no, no, it gets added, like, another another uh, couple guns for the SMG. Epic or anything. That's, that's all we need. We don't need the drum gun back. No, it didn't sound cool. It didn't look cool. It wasn't an iconic gun. No, no, no. Keep an SMG. Yeah, that's. Smart. Also, keeping all the random snipers, all the other random guns that make it impossible to get the guns that you want. You know, there should only be tight. There should only be assault rifles, scars, pump shotguns. Um, it's one type of every gun. All right, you don't need all the other type of guns. You don't need the uh, burst. You don't need all the other type of assault rifles. We don't need a heavy shotgun. We don't need uh, a tactic. You just have the pump shotgun. That's all. We don't need a legendary shotgun, double barrel. We don't need them. And I kind of hate Fortnite, Epic Games. We're doing this all the time. Um, another thing that I want to talk about is the modes. Now, back in like season three, they had even beforehand, all the modes felt like they were in the game. I just want to touch this quickly down on the video. Just want to make this short, but the modes were in. The realm of Fortnite. You had solo, duo, squads. You had 50 v 50, uh, five teams of 20. Um, you had all these teams with different numbers of people, and they felt like they're in Fortnite. Now we have food fight. That's ridiculous. We have um, disco dominate. That's ridiculous. That's not in the realm of Fortnite. Either. It's food fight. Um, the heist thing. That's not on Fortnite. The only mode that I should say that is out of the ordinary is the Thanos mode. Like I said, the Thanos mode was part of Season 4. It was superhero based. None of the other things are based off of the, uh, the season. Disco Dominating Food Fight were in Season 6. That was when Halloween was around. It's spooky. Those weren't spooky. <laughs> Dancing Around isn't spooky. Well, actually, I think Disco Dominating. No, Disco Dominating was in Season 6, yeah. Also, Team Rumble, I should say, is probably in the realm of Fortnite. Even though I kind of hate it because you always just die by tryhards and you get one shot but it's not bad in the sense that it's not in the realm of Fortnite. it's in the realm of in the realm of fortnite where it's all about killing if the mode is all about killing then that's in it but with this will dominate that doesn't count because it you you dance on dance floor to get points and you don't win by killing people you win by capturing points it's not in fortnite fortnite is about killing and being victorious in killing the last player alive. If there's other players left, that's not Fortnite. Unless you have a victory royale sign and you're in a team. If 50-50 mode, for example, you're in two different teams, you have a 50-50 chance of winning. So if you win with like 10 people left, that counts as being in the realm of Fortnite. You get what I'm saying? This is gonna keep on coming along because we're in the 14 days of Fortnite miss and they have all these different type of modes. They just don't feel like Fortnite. Is, they're just gonna keep on doing this because they don't because I believe these modes uh, keep players in the the loop and they just keep us entertained. Because if there wasn't any modes, then that's basically it. 
and where you're just gonna get bored. And including Playground Mode, I think, is where it started with these modes that are out of the ordinary and crazy. Because Playground Mode is basically just you being in an island all by yourself for an hour, or with your friends, and like, being by yourself is boring after you do it a couple of times, there's nothing else to do, the map isn't that entertaining, unless it's like the beginning of a new season, you just want to check it out without being interrupted, but other than that, Playground Mode just seems pointless unless you're playing with friends, but I like it there forever, because that's fine, but everything else just seems really ridiculous, but I'm going to end the video now, I think I said enough, so if you guys have uh, enjoyed this video, then uh, you, you want to support this channel, hit the like and subscribe, I just made this this video just to, uh, to just get off my mind, I'm just been rambling, just, uh, I just had this in my mind throughout Christmas, so, I just want to tell you now, so if you want to give your opinions, comment down below, even though you won't, <laughs> I'm going to go now, so bye. Yeah, I confess, father, I confess.